So, if you want to start a business right now, while you're in college, the first thing you want to ask is, should you? you know, should you start a business? Chances are that you're very busy. You've got exams to study for, you've got exams what, three weeks, two weeks, something like that. Uh, you've got activities, you've got sports, uh, you've got a social life. I mean, it, it takes time, it takes a whole lot of time. It's, it's a full-time effort to starting a business, but it's pretty tough to start on part-time too. Chances are also that you're cash poor. Being a, being a student financially is pretty tough. Most of them I know live on ramen noodles. Uh, you, you, don't, you don't really have a whole lot of money for, you know, for much of anything, much less than not in town, much less starting a company. But if you can find a way to have some access to capital so that you can start your own company, and I'm going to give you a few suggestions on how you do that, then well, maybe this is something you can do after all. Chances are you don't quite know what you want to do. Um, you all seem like pretty smart, focused people, but none of us really know what we want to do, okay? Um, you might think you know what you want to do, but along the way in life, sometimes you fail at things, you fail at pursuing your goals, people tell you that you can't do it, uh, you, you run into one obstacle after another, one setback after another, and you get discouraged and you just settle for something other than what you really ought to be doing. So we're going to talk about that too. Entrepreneurship in college, if you decide to do it, use campus resources while they're still available to you. What are those? Well, you got professors, you got advisors, uh, you got people that, that you can trust, and you've got a lot of really competent help. A place like this tends to attract some really good business talent. Uh, you got research, you got the library, you got great uh, you know, stock research, maybe you got Bloomberg down there in the library. Uh, but most importantly, you got each other, you got fellow students. And it's always great to be in an environment where people can bounce ideas off of each other. Also, you can take all of your skills that you learn if you're trying to start a business, and you can you can turn yourself into a better, into a better leader, both in business and in life, if you just start easy. Something where there's not a whole lot of risk, and just try and see where it goes. So go ahead and screw up now. If you're going to screw up, do it now. Do it now while there's not a whole lot of cost to it. I'm not saying that you should go and try to start a bank or an air, you know, an aircraft manufacturer, anything big. Start something small ticket, if you decide to go that route.